On this lecture video, I will be showing you on how to assess the integumentary system. Materials needed Examination light or pen light Clean gloves Cotton swab or applicator Centimeter ruler Examination gown or drape And tray this procedure is preferably done sitting or supine in bed. Client may remain sitting for most of the examination. To assess the skin on buttocks and dorsal surfaces of the legs properly, the client may lie on her side or bottom. Make sure the room is not cold or hot because this may cause cyanosis or flushing. Remove all clothing except for examination gown. Drape the client well for warmth and privacy. Make sure also to use good tangential lighting all throughout the procedure. Observe for general hygiene condition. Note if the client is clean, well-groomed, or if the hair is combed properly. Inspect skin integrity for color variations, lesions, erythema, noting for symmetry of the skin color and shade. Do this from head to toes and from anterior to posterior areas of the body. Remove any hair pins, ties, wigs, or hair pieces, and undo braids. Note the color, quantity, distribution for presence of symmetry of body hair in the scalp, body, axillae, and pubic hair. For the scalp, the wooden end of the cotton swab can be used to make small parts in the hair so that the scalp can be inspected at 1 inch intervals. Carefully separate strands of hair to check for skin color, integrity, or for presence of lesions, lice infestation, scales or flakes, redness, itching, bumps, or masses. 
use centimeter ruler to measure scars in approximating its length. Check skin carefully to note for breakdown on pressure point areas like elbows, hips, and sacrum, and use a scale to document the degree of skin breakdown. If any skin breakdown is noted, use appropriate scale to document the degree of the skin breakdown. To check for skin texture, use the palmar surface of the fingers and finger pads. For the degree of moisture, using light palpation, check under skin folds and in unexposed areas using pads of fingers. To assess for skin turgor, pinch or lift a fold of skin between thumb and forefinger on the hand, forearm, over the sternum, clavicle, or on the radial aspect of the wrist. Check skin temperature with the back or using palms of the hands. Palpate the forehead or the face first. Continue to palpate inferiorly, including the hands and feet. Comparing the temperature on the left and right side of the body if they are symmetrical. Inspect fingernails for color, shape, contour, smoothness, thickness, grooming, cleanliness, and lesions. And then, palpate for texture. Test capillary refill by pressing nail tip or compress the nail bed until it blanches for 5 seconds. Release the pressure and calculate the time it takes for the color to return. Repeat this procedure with the client's toenails. Thank you.